friends welcome to my channel my name is stint and today i'm going to teach you this image a uh, gallery when you just click it here and it's open uh, like this one next next previous previous okay so if you want to add more images you just copy your images okay you just copy and just paste go to your project folder i'm using a zamp okay just ht doc this is my demo project and inside you just paste it here and image uh, has been added so just refresh f5 for refresh and you can see here image automatically added okay if you uh, need uh, more images just copy and paste it here uh, that will automatically edit it, uh, it here okay so we will uh, do using a glow function and if you uh, want to do title of that image so you need to add a database okay and uh, so but this is the globe functions of uh, php so i'm not showing uh, that to add the title of dynamic okay so so let's get into a uh, code so first we need to create a project okay so so first we uh, need to uh, project so just this i'm on the same just create a project which is the php and uh, php underscore tutorial okay and it enter and uh, just uh, drag and drop uh, that file okay uh, just minute okay so just drag and drop uh, your project inside in your code editor okay so it's a uh, it's open my project uh, this one but it's uh, doesn't uh, doesn't have any file so just you need to create the file which uh, it here so the file which is the index dot uh, php and index.html as well you can create but I am creating index.php just finish it here okay so this is the blank html file so first we need to type html tag okay just minute html html should be closed okay and here head section head section should be closed and title tag and title tag should be closed so this is the image gallery okay and here we want to add a body okay so we need to some container main container okay and inside i want to uh, put h1 or h2 whatever you just want to so image gallery control s for save and now we need to run these files just open your browser and uh, and type okay actually my computer is gonna hang it's not responding sorry for that so just local host it here okay local host local host and uh, forward slash and php underscore tutorial this is my Tuto re yeah this is my project and hit enter so it's a run okay so now we uh, need to uh, add the some uh, images it here so first we need to uh, some images so you just uh, copy and paste from your computer okay so my images is uh, on the desktop okay so just go to a desktop these are the my images okay three images and uh, we will add more later so just uh, create a new folder on your project so this is the php tutorial and you just uh, this is the images okay and just paste it here so uh, we have uh, added we want to add more images so just go to it here okay uh, another folder i have and just paste it here in your project so i have added uh, one two three four five i think seven six seven images we have a uh, copy and paste to our project folder okay so the, the so it here you just type a php okay and uh, php just it has a function which is the globe g l o b globe function okay and it takes two pair parameters okay so first parameter is your folder name folder name uh, in our project has images just have to copy the name of your project uh, 
file uh, folder and just paste it here okay and put forward slash okay and after forward slash you just uh, need to add a curly bracket okay and we want to all the files all the files means all the files uh, it, uh, all the files from this uh, uh, from this folder okay uh, which has the jpg extension and uh, we want to uh, if your images has a uh, uh, has a png extension as well so all the uh, star means all the uh, files which has exten extension is png okay so control s for save and next parameter is the globe brass g l o globe mm, globe brass this one okay and uh, semicolon and just and just store inside the dir means a directory so just you need to print r and you see which thing it returns so control s for save and now refresh the browser so it it you can see here okay just nope you can see here it returns the array okay image one all the images uh, it returns zero position is this image one position has this image and uh, two position have this image and three position have this image fourth position have this image all the images we written uh, in array so we need to to get uh, this images using the while okay and for loop whatever you just want to do uh, use that i am using the for each loop it here for each e a c h for each loop okay uh, for each loop and just close it here okay so just copy and uh, copy and paste uh, this dir it here okay and uh, this is us key and value pair so dollar key uh, as a value okay just minute uh, and dollar value control s for save and now we uh, need to uh, now we need to <coughs> uh, now uh, we need uh, now we need to add uh, some uh, links and html just uh, just close uh, php tag and uh, and open php tag okay php just open php tag okay and inside i want to add uh, image tag Im img src okay src and uh, src and put alt tag okay so alt tag also have image name okay so just uh, just just uh, just uh, put a uh, php tag closing and php take uh, i mean opening and closing tape and inside you want to echo that value okay if you need to uh, remove this key as well okay just copy this value and paste it here okay and put a semicolon control s for save now refresh the browser so you can see here uh, this image first image added okay second image added all the images it here so will uh, here so we want to also the alt take just copy okay and just paste it here Control S and just uh, give it a style for so you need to add uh, I mean wrap uh, some 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 links okay some links and some divs and some elements as well so first uh, just copy it, uh, just paste it here okay so wrap inside a div okay div div should be closed and just give it a class uh, because we are in a for loop so this is the thumb uh, thumbnails okay and inside I want to okay just a letter just control exit here and paste it here control s for save and now refresh so the same result will be here okay so now we need to give a uh, style sheet so I am using uh, internal CSS it here inside a head section okay so put it style and style uh, text should be closed okay so we uh, need to uh, write some CSS uh, to add the uh, to give a specific width and height so body first we start the body okay body tag 
so body take uh, its a margin is zero by default uh, it has some margin padding as well as zero okay and background i want to a ccc okay control s for save and uh, first uh, we need to uh, change the thumbnail actually we want to uh, this thumbnail just copy this is the class so we have added the dot okay so thumbnail size width uh, i want to a 30 percent okay and uh, float we want to a left okay and the margin we want to all of that uh, 10 10 pixel top top left right bottom okay uh, all the sides and we want to a background background fff okay and uh, we also want to a padding uh, 20 pixel suppose okay and uh, box sizing because we give uh, why we are giving the box sizing if you give the 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 padding so the container size will be increased so to to manage that uh, for the responsive uh, layout we just put a box sizing uh, border uh, border box okay and uh, overflow okay uh, just uh, give it overflow later control s for save and now refresh so it's a uh, doesn't uh, it takes any effect okay why because we uh, didn't set the uh, inside we have thumbnail i mean thumbnail and inside have the images okay so this is the images okay so images size uh, width uh, should be 100 percent means have 30 percent and 30 percent width width it's a uh, hundred percent okay means the images will be hundred percent means completely cover the uh, this thumbnail okay and height should be auto automatically adjust auto okay control s for save and now we need to refresh this browser okay, okay so you can see here uh, these are the images okay and uh, and uh, just uh, to make a center to for that we have a main tag uh, which one this one just copy and uh, it here after body we just paste it here okay give it a width and height so width i want to do 80 percent okay and margin i want to a uh, zero pixel and auto uh, top and bottom is uh, zero pixel and left and right is automatically okay so control s for save and now refresh the browser so it's a uh, it's a center now okay so just uh, give it a width is 25 percent control s for save and uh, refresh uh, refresh so it's a uh, it's not looking good okay control s for save okay uh, these are the images will uh, add it automatically okay so we need to add uh, more images just copy and paste your images uh, so where is my images is i think just copy these images i have already added but uh, i want to add one more time just copy and go to your project and paste it here again okay so just uh, skip it mm, okay just new images um actually have didn't have any more images here so just paste it here okay let me decide later um, continue okay okay mm -mm -mm. ts not 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 actually i don't have the images right now just demo uh, this is the images just copy some more images copy and go to your project okay and just paste it here mm. okay just replaced it so now refresh so the more images uh, edit it here automatically you can see here okay so it's look good okay so now we need to add a gallery like this one just minute okay okay when you just click uh, this will happen okay so just uh, go to uh, open your browser and type a fancy box fan fancy box okay so just click it here okay and click it here 
okay and just download okay it's gonna download okay uh, so it's it has been downloaded you just uh, open that folder okay so this is my folder just right click and extract it here okay so now we need to uh, so this is the fancy box we go to dist and we need to two files which is this one just copy and uh, paste inside in your project so this is my project and paste it here and we now we need to add that files okay so inside the head section just drag mm, okay just you can type uh, okay you just type like this one a style I mean link uh, first we need to add a, uh, a script tag a script tag a script tag should be closed okay and src and src is the this uh, jquery i mean fancy box and uh, we want to also also a link href and uh, this is the css file and it's related to the style seed okay so now we need to one more file which is the jquery okay so jquery go to jquery cdn and just click this link okay and just click it here and just copy this link okay and come again it here and top of your all the files just paste inside head section just remove it okay okay control s for save and uh, just go to the documentation fancy box documentation and click it here uh, images and you just copy uh, this links okay and come it here in, in your project it here and just paste it here okay so this is the image so we have to replace just a uh, little bit so this is the image we have to replace just replace it here and just control X and paste in place of that okay and inside href we want to add also just copy this one okay just copy and paste it here and has been done our image gallery okay so now we need to refresh okay when you just click okay 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 just minute uh, when you just click uh, it's open okay okay so this is the image gallery uh, so if you want to add a title of it here okay so just come um, this is the thumbnail and inside thumbnail we want to add a title so just put h2 and h1 whatever you just want to do that so this is the title ti tle title of image this will from a database you can add okay so that will uh, dynamically and it's a caption as well so just remove this one and just copy okay just copy and paste it here so what is the caption i want to show you just refresh okay and just click it here okay so the caption will not come why okay because it didn't put uh, i think have the problem is mm, okay Control S for save and now refresh. Just remove it here and click. This is the caption. Okay, so this uh, will also comes. Uh, this video is uh, very long, so for sorry for that. Uh, so if you like this video, please subscribe my channel and I will come with uh, uh, new things. Uh, till then, bye. Take care.